Welcome to another Demarcation Media Mega Constructs review. Today we're going to be taking a look at an older set. This is the Oni Mongoose. So this is a pretty straightforward set. We have a Mongoose, a Spartan, and a Rocket Launcher. Can't get much more simple than that. Front of the box, we see the set in action. Top we see the Spartan. And around the back, we kind of just see it all over again. We get a shot of the Enforcer and we get a look at the infamous uh, Hellbringer Cyclops or whatever the official name is. Pretty simple box. Let's go ahead and get it open. Now there doesn't seem to be any easy open tabs or anything so I guess we just do this and then That's what we get inside. We have our instructions. And we have one, two, three, and four bags of parts. So let me go ahead and build this and we'll take a closer look. And we are done. And we have this abnormally large pile of extras. Like, what? This is such a small set and there's so many extra pieces. I thought I built something wrong, but that's just how it is. This is technically not an extra, as is one of these rockets. Officially, it only comes with one rocket, but apparently it comes with two. But there's a lot of extras here and there's a lot of really good extras too. Um, the build itself was so different from the Halo Infinite Mongoose. And I'll do a comparison with them in just a minute. But first, let's go ahead and take a look at that Spartan. There he is, Spartan Enforcer. This is a very nice shade of blue. The visor pops really well. Um, aside from the visor, there is no print. But he kind of doesn't even really need it. Like, he looks really good just straight out of the box like this. Um, and I really like the Enforcer armor. I think it just looks really cool. Kind of reminds me of like a Jaeger or something from Pacific Rim. Kind of a silvery stand. And then obviously his big honking Halo, I think it's Halo 5 style rocket launcher. Um, unfortunately, we don't get any of that cool like smoke trail effect. But we do get a missile and a clear pole. So we can have him firing a rocket like that. I think that's a nice effect, pretty neat. Adds some uh, diorama possibilities. And as I mentioned before, we do get a second missile. So that's very cool. Again, great figure. The Enforcer armor is such a cool design and that is a fantastic shade of blue. So here is the Oni Mongoose itself. And for such a small vehicle, this was a super complex build. You build in every which way. You have all of these special pieces. Uh, we even get a little printed Oni tile, which is super cool. And then these back wheels are on this assembly that can move. So you could do that, which <laughs> that actually looks really funny. But it's kind of like suspension. It only is on the back though. Um, and it is, I don't know quite why, but it is a little bit off kilter. So one of the tires doesn't quite touch the ground, whereas the other one is. I don't know if that's just parts flexing or what. Um, but that's a little awkward. Overall though, I really like the design of this. It looks like a really solid off-road vehicle and the gray color scheme is great. So let me drop in. First of all, that is the uh, mongoose from the building box. It looks like a little kid's drive around toy next to this one. And then we have the Halo Infinite mongoose. They are visually kind of similar, but the build was so incredibly different and honestly, the Oni 
Goose has more detail. I honestly think these look great side by side. Definitely this one's suspension wins out in the end, but I still think this one for being an older set, let me see, let me check the box. When did this one come out? This was 2018 set. So it's a couple years old now. And I think it still holds up really nicely. So let me go ahead and put the Spartan on, probably freak my camera out in the process. There's actual little single foot rest pieces here. That's kind of cool. It can grab on like so. It's a little awkward to get a figure to sit on a mongoose or a gun goose without looking a little awkward, but there we go. I think that looks pretty good. Looks like he's ready to mow down some probably insurrectionists if it's an Oni thing. Um, and then we got a clip here, which I guess maybe is for a weapon, but you'd have to rotate this clip. Hey, that actually works out pretty good. I like that. I especially like the fact that you can carry a whole entire rocket launcher on the back. Well, there you have it. That is the Oni Mongoose. And I gotta say, I was far more impressed by this set than I was expecting to be. That build is really nice. Like, it was it was a very involved build. I enjoyed it quite a bit. The figure is good. He is, for a lot of people, probably a little on the plain side, but that Enforcer armor does look fantastic, and the blue is great. I like the rocket launcher and the fact that we got the clear pole to display the one shooting off. Uh, getting that smoke trail out the back would have been great, but that's asking a little too much for such a small set. Um, overall, though, I really recommend the set, or even a couple of them if you want a little squad of the Oni mongoose. Uh, would it be mongoose? Anyway, only complaint that I have is the fact that this suspension on the back seems to land a little bit crooked for some reason or another. I don't entirely know why that is but you can see it kind of rocks back and forth that's my only real complaint about this set other than that this is fantastic thanks so much for watching if you enjoyed this video please leave a like and consider subscribing and i'll see you next time